Welcome back to the Be Jones Style channel. I am in my car right now because usually that means that I am going thrifting and I am, but I'm so excited because today I've been teasing this out. I am doing a really exciting collab video. You guys are gonna be so pumped with who I'm shopping with. I'm not gonna share who it is just yet. We're gonna head to the thrift store and you're gonna meet who I'm shopping with. So exciting. We are at one of my favorites. I don't know if you guys remember, we went to the same St. Vincent's de Paul thrift store in Long Beach. I think I did that like ultimate day of thrifting where I thrifted for three hours in one store. This is that store. So I'm so excited to take you guys inside because usually I find some incredible gems while I'm here. And I'm really pumped because I'm taking somebody with me who never has shopped here. So it's gonna be really cool to see what we both find while we're inside. Without further ado, let's just get into this. I'm gonna take you guys over there and I'm gonna introduce you to my special guest today. Yay, Erica from Tiny Acorn. So we did a collab video kind of recently. Yes, we did. Separate. And I teased out that we would hopefully be getting together soon and we did. You guys have been asking for this, us getting together, I thrifting. Know. I'm so excited to go in together. Yeah, that's awesome. And what's so fun is I am bringing her to one of my favorite places to thrift. I want to introduce you to Erica. If you have not already started following her channel, you need to. It's called Tiny Acorn. And what is your channel all about? My channel is all about just making fashion accessible for everyone. I feel like thrifting and like styling with vintage clothing. You don't have to have a lot of money in order to be fashionable. And you can find really, really unique pieces, thrifting or like at your local secondhand store. Yeah, and then you can put outfits together that really reflect your own unique sense of style. So yeah, I just love helping women sort of find what they vibe with and know that they can like have confidence to just wear what they feel good in. And it doesn't have to be like some designer or you know, what is like currently in the stores. You can find awesome, awesome pieces that are secondhand, and it's also good for the environment, so that's good Yay! Too. Erica did not mention this. She does this crazy thing where after she thrifts, she styles so many outfits and shows it's, so yeah. many outfits, which it's amazing, and I am <laughs> in awe of her ability to take the time to style up all these ideas for you guys. So if you need some outfit inspiration, you definitely need to go to her channel and check it out because not only do you get to thrift with her, you get boatloads of inspiration. So that is one amazing thing besides many others that make her awesome. Aww. So go check her out. <laughs> we're gonna go in the thrift store today. We're gonna do something a little bit different where we're gonna kind of do our own thing in the thrift store and she's gonna film for her channel. I'm gonna film, of course, for my channel here. And you guys are gonna see what I'm finding, but then you're gonna hop over to her channel and see what she's finding. And then we're gonna meet up at the dressing room and prize each other with our finds. Yes. I think it's gonna be so much fun. When you go into the thrift mm -hmm. store, like, do you bring kind of little logged in inspiration or are there certain things you are looking for? Do you mm. kind of go in with any kind of a plan? Certain areas that I go to first, depending on my mood. I hardly ever go to the shirts. <laughs> like for some Why reason, do we all do that? We all do it. I don't know. I, I like. I love going to the dress section. It feels section. like a lot more or something. I don't know. Yeah, it's like because you're. I think because you're like sifting through like so many like tank tops, horrible and, like, things. Polo, yes. like, I don't know. It's just. Yeah. <laughs> you know, and it feels a little maybe less inspirational, but it is yeah. amazing how you need a good shirt. Oh my gosh, I know. So and so my wardrobe, I'm like, I constantly am like, shirts. I need shirts. Yes. Why am I not? So I'll probably look in the shirts today. Pause for one second. Have you checked out the girls' sifted clothing? Oh my gosh. They're so yes. cute. They did a thrifting video where oh, they yes, just they did. the shirts. Yes. And I was like, that's such a genius idea. I feel uh -huh. like we both should do that too, yes. like in collab again with them yeah. or something. Anyways, go check them out too. Yes. Go ahead. So any yeah. other tips so, or how you approach thrifting? Yeah, so I am like looking for like any sort of like vintage pattern. I have actually like had like a vintage store for years. I hone in yes. on those like vintage colors and patterns and I'm like always checking the tag to see if it's vintage. Yes, totally. And like 
for me, and it's maybe, like better if it is. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, ask me like, how do you know it's a vintage tag? Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah, what I would know, you say? Like, it's like the names. Yeah. Um. So like, mostly I can tell that the tag is vintage. Um. Oftentimes, like, there's yellowing on the mm. tag, or it's like frayed. Um. Or you can tell by like the font. Mm -hmm. uh, totally. More the, like. If it's that like 70s, yeah, like Yeah, or like the embroidered tag. Nowadays, you know, fast fashion and whatnot, like they just print stuff on the tag. So back then it's it was like, like sewn in. Yeah, yeah, it was it was a lot more like detailed. Mm -hmm. Like, um, or sometimes yeah. it's like Betsy's of California or Lucy's or you know, it's like Brands? kitchy. Like, yeah, 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 it's yeah, kind of yeah. like they were made homemade, probably. Blair. And, yes, like, yes. Just, like, and then just, like good 80s tags are always fun to find. Yeah. Those are like, Cleo or mm -hmm. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Blair is like a huge yeah. vintage. Is is anything 20 years or older yeah so you're looking for things that are like from like the 90s or before mm -hmm. and I feel like it's once you start like being familiar with like styles and like tags and all that and fabric yeah fabric you, is you, a big thing yeah you mm -hmm. kind of start to like see like what is vintage and what is not so I don't know if that's helpful no that's very helpful <laughs> we're gonna go in the store you guys are gonna follow me around you're gonna follow her on her channel and then we're gonna meet up at the dressing room and you guys are gonna get to see what we're finding I'm so excited so let's go we're gonna split up and go see what we can find so you're gonna follow me and see my treasures hop over to Erica's channel to go see the treasure she's finding but then we're gonna meet up a few times. I'm sure we'll meet up in the store, but I'll go start in the section I don't usually start in. I'll start in the shirts. Okay, cool. Because it's the complicated section. Do you have any thoughts before you hop in? I am looking for a few things today. I'm looking for midi length skirts. Um, and I'm also looking for like a beaded bag or something like that. Um, some sort of like fun statement bag. And then I'm looking for anything green. Yes. Because my hair's changed, so oh, I, I know, like... I love it. Okay, so we've split up. I'm gonna start hunting, Erica's hunting, and we're both gonna kinda see what we can find. Okay, I already found this slip dress that I love. It's satin up top and then it's sheer on the bottom. Like this could be really cool for layering. Okay, I just found some shoes that are really cute. Not my size, I think they might be Erica's, I'm not sure. But how cute are these shoes? I feel like Erica look, could look so cute in these. Found this top. I really like it. I also feel like Erica would look great in this. I'm gonna pull it for her. I have been looking in shirts. I've found a lot. I'm gonna show you guys a few of the things that I've found. I think I like this. It's like one of those good little like hippie shirts. I've been seeing this look pop up a lot on the runways. I don't mind. But more of that light wash pinstripe. I love how long this is. I feel like this could be really great for layering. And then when I saw this on the rack, you guys, I, I actually out loud said something. Look at this. It's a vintage sweatshirt. Henry, his fraternity sweatshirt from Delta. I'm in love. Also, some more options. I found this really great black blazer um, for myself. I realize I don't have just a classic black blazer. Um, I found for myself, I like this vest. Very 90s, like a cool little duster coat type thing. <gasps> We're meeting up. Yeah. How's it going for you? How do you feel? Yeah. Um, Your cart's getting I, a little full. Yeah, my cart's like almost totally full now. Um, I'm excited because I found some like really fun colorful pieces. Oh yay! Yeah. So I'm hoping that like they'll fit. I have a few things for you. No pressure to like any of them. You say yes, yes. or no. Okay. okay. No pressure. I thought they were so cute. <gasps> Oh my gosh, those are cute. Little loafers. I wasn't sure, but here's like a top that I found. Oh my gosh, I love Campus it. Casuals Campus Casuals of California. That's such a good brand. That is. You guys so I thought that was very cute for you. You might not know, but I love red. Oh, yay. Like, I have so much red in my wardrobe. Erica lives in San Francisco, so they get to wear more layers more often. I did find this layers that was really day. great. Oh, like, that is kind of classic. So that's an option. Feels oh, weird. Janssen. That's a good vintage brand. Yay. I have to show you this vintage sweatshirt that I found. Henry's <gasps> Delta oh fraternity my sweatshirt. Like, how no, good is that? That is so awesome. And it's like shrunken and small <gasps> and hand stitched. Like, Dying inside. So that is I saw this on the rack gem. and I went, oh my gosh, like out loud. I was just like, <gasps> I haven't shown any of these yet. So I'm just gonna show them all and okay. the few that are for you as well. For sure for you. I saw this like oh my gosh, I love little I plaid love top. It has like little balloony sleeves. So another little, what is this, 80s 
probably. Oh, that's cute. Red yeah, again, so a little fun. tie. Really fun. And then this one as well is another like 70s. I don't know, it's like so cute. I love yeah. it. For myself, oh, this I one is really that. cool. That is so Just cool. Just the print, I feel like is really fun to play with. Oh, yeah. And this is really fun. I love this. Oh my gosh. Like, it looks like a pilgrim mm -hmm. top. Ah, I love it. So cute. We are going to go start trying some things on. Yes. I think we have a lot. I'm going to show you guys our cart. You guys, Erica found me this. You have to go watch on her channel what this is. It's so good. <laughs> and then Erica's cart over here. She's a little more organized than me, I feel like. <laughs> so we're going to go try things on. You guys, Erica found this for me. How amazing is this? This. It's like a smoking jacket looking dress thing for Christmas. So cool. It's so cozy. For this uh, this winter. Yes, yes, with your hair color. <gasps> and even, I like it with what you're wearing. What I'm wearing like you yeah. could even belt it, I feel like. Yeah. I found this, which I feel like is just a really good layering piece. I love like a long, I think this is supposed to probably be a dress, but I, it's almost like a shirt option. And then I like the idea of layering even like long trousers, kind of balloony trousers with it, and maybe like a jacket. I just think there's a lot of potential to work with this. I'm so proud of myself. I did shirt galore this time. Shirts galore. <laughs> okay, I found this that is maybe my favorite so far. It's so cute. I love the black and white. It feels very Chanel. In love, in love with Henry and his Delta sweatshirt and I love this about this sweatshirt a lot of times sweatshirts are really large and I end up not wanting to wear them but because this is like kind of small it's perfect for tucking it in to all my high waist things I just found this black blazer which I really like I like this because it's very structured I like the idea of belting this a lot that's a big trend coming up for fall is like belted blazers this is cute vests do we wear them I don't know I do like the idea of this, like, as a shirt, and then I just have, like, trousers on. I like that idea. Okay, look how cute Erica looks in the shirt. Show us <laughs> how fabulous this is. So There's I passed, and then she I took it. In. Yes, because it, it's armpit. a hole, yeah. I'll just sew it up. See, I'm cool. not good like that. I don't sew like, things, so I just realize I have to accept my faults. <laughs> my I've seen a button here, but... Isn't it cute with your hair right now? And then I found this coat that makes me very happy it's like a smoking jacket vibe like the color this rust color it's heavenly i love all the little details like the little braiding right here even on the arms it has a little cinched belt so cute look at the detail of the how the buttons go off to the side and then show me the dolman sleeve i feel like that's really a cute shape and the print. I need blouses in my life. I don't have enough good blouses. And then I found this, which is like kind of this, I think it's probably from the 90s, that like when the hippie thing was kind of big in the 90s. Um, it goes off the shoulder, cute little sleeves. This is a case to find just basics, yeah. but that make a statement. Because it's kind of the way it hangs, a little oversized, but it's not oversized, and yeah, like the pockets. You could tie it at the waist too yes. if you wanted, or like wear it with a skirt. And Very cute. You could even wear it open. I feel like that yes. does that a lot. <laughs> I'm trying this on. I'm not 100% sure. I feel like Erica might need to try this on because this might be more her. Oh, look. Come here. We're cute. Twinsies. <laughs> look how cute we are. Yay. Jeans and white tank top. <laughs> <laughs> what you should wear and you're trying to try on clothes at a thrift store. <laughs> White, white tank tops and jeans. So I thought that Beth said we were doing a color video today. Oh, sorry. <laughs> because her, her phone auto-corrected to color. And uh, I, I was trying to say collab. Collab and video. It corrected to color. So I wore my, my most colorful dress. And it turns oh out it's not the best to try wait, to close Wait, wait, wait. So then what did you respond back? You're like, oh, ha, ha, color video, right? Yeah, I was like, oh, we're doing a color video. Awesome. And I was like, yeah, hilarious color video. I was joking, like thinking she was joking. But she really thought we were doing a color video. I did. Sorry. She has done Way a color video. So that's maybe why. And you need to go yeah. check out her color video. So it's really good. Yeah, this is that slip. It's very sassy, sexy vibes. But I like the idea of layering this with some other things. And then, how cute! Is it good? I, I mean, I love it. 
It's so cute. It's a little, like it kind of has little puff sleeves right here, kind of. I'm like a huge fan of buttoning things all the way all up. All the way up. Mm -hmm. Okay, Erica found my favorite pants. Look how cute these are, guys. I love. They almost have a paper bag waist a little bit. They're extremely high. Erica should just be my pants shopper because she found all the perfect pants. These are so cute. I love, they're super comfy. These are Liz Claiborne, right? This dress was made for Erica. How cute is this? It fits her so perfectly and I love that color on you. I feel like it's perfect for San Francisco. Yes. Because it's like a, it's like a thin sweater material, yes. but I so love the length. Yes. It's so unique. I've never seen anything like this. We are done trying things on. It was fun. It was like fun. Good stuff, right? Yes. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to do a quick haul of all the things that I picked okay. up. Uh, Erica found two amazing pants. I'm going to bring home these high waist pants and also the white ones. My Liz Claiborne. Also going to bring home this slip. Ooh. Even if I wear it at nighttime, who knows? But I like the idea of actually bringing this out into the daytime. Love this little black. Okay. Gauzy top. This beautiful iconic. I feel like that was. Doesn't that look like a designer so from the 70s or something? Yeah. Or it's like definitely like a high end. It yeah. looks very high end and it feels that way too. This just great classic black blazer. I imagine belting this a lot this fall. This. Yeah. Sweater. <laughs> So that was one of my favorites. Yay, I love it. My little pilgrim shirt, very Chanel, black and white. And this is just, I feel like, a good layering piece. I imagine this, even with those linen trousers, I would probably do like a little blazer over that. Then, you guys, Erica scored when she found this. <laughs> that one's so much I mean, fun. Merry Christmas, right? Like, thank you for my Christmas present. <laughs> I love it. You only wear this at Christmas time. No, you can wear it all the time. I think so? I think so. Okay, definitely like winter. Yeah. Yeah. I love oh, it. I liked how when you had it open, yeah, it was really cute. You know what would be really cool is like wear it as a dress, but then black combat boots. Ooh, yeah. Would be kind of cool, edgy. like toughen it up a little bit. I love it. Favorite items you got were this yes. one. Extremely jealous. So good. I think I might just like Could we find a sweatshirt like this and just like embroider on yes. it. So good. Um, this one looks so good on her, and it's just so unique, yeah. and I've never seen anything like it. We did it. We conquered. We scored. We, we scored. had fun. It was so much fun! It was awesome. Yay! I'm, I'm so happy that it was a good day, you know yeah. what I mean? Like that we had... We found some stuff. Yeah, yeah. a lot of finds, and it was fun because we both found stuff for each other. Pretty much everything I got, you found for me. No, but that, I think that was like, actually, I've never done that in a video where we're almost like separately thrifting, yeah. but then how you can spot things for the other person. Because mm -hmm. we've tuned in enough to know yeah. like what each other likes, so that yeah, was really totally. fun. Hey, oh my goodness. We had so much fun thrifting. I hope you guys had a blast watching us thrift. I loved having you join me. Thank you for yes. driving down here. Oh my gosh. So, I wish I could do this every weekend. I know. <laughs> Like-minded thrifters. Yes. So much fun. If you guys have not, I'm sure you already have, but please go over to Erica's channel right now. There's a link below to her video and you can see what she was finding and thrifting along the way. You can actually get a little more detail on all of your finds yeah. and her breaking it down for you guys. And if you have not, go subscribe to her channel. Like I said, she does such fun videos. She gives you tons of outfit ideas. And she's just an overall awesome person. So <laughs> if you have not, please subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And do you want to do the sign off with me? Yes. Okay. Always, Always play dress up. up. Bye. Bye.